Okay guys, check this trick out. I think it's pretty cool. All right, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna lay the deck down and you guys are gonna pick a card and tell me when to stop. Obviously, you're not here, so I'll tell you when to stop. So let's just start dropping and stop. All right, the card's gonna be seven of diamonds. That'll be our card. We'll put it right there to the side so it gets out of our way. Oh yeah, these are a brand new deck, so um, it's hard to put on to. But now what we're going to do is we're gonna pick three more cards all right so let's go ahead and spread the deck all right and i'll pick one first um yeah i'll pick the first one ace all right now what we're gonna do is i'm gonna place the ace somewhere here i don't know where just anywhere it doesn't matter here i'll place it where i can't even see the card so nobody would think i'm cheating or something so what do we got here we're placing the cards right there and this will tell us what cards we have picked this. It was in front of this one. It's the diamond, and what's behind it is the Battle Club. So this, these will be our cards. These have been the cards that have been chosen. All right. We'll put this deck to the side, and now we have our chosen cards. All right. So we got the all the cards that we wanted to be chosen. Let's go ahead and identify because you always got to identify each card before each trick con continues we want to make sure that we we properly um talk about which card is which so in this case we're going to um review each card so we got of course we got the uh the queen queen of diamonds okay we'll put that one down um next card that we'll talk about is the history of the the mighty fine uh five of clubs which remember it's almost uh st patrick's day so we got the five of clubs blah 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 of course we got the the uh seven of diamonds and the um you know ace of spades now what we want to do next is we're going to grab our deck now okay and i what i'm going to do is i'm going to put the ace just like this as you can see hopefully the camera can see we're going to put it somewhere Somewhere, somewhere, somewhere deep in the deck in the middle. Get in there. Hope you guys can see that. And then we're gonna we're going to split the deck in two. Boom. Boom. Okay. But there's one little thing I forgot to tell you guys is that to make this trick happen, I cannot use a blue deck. It has to be a red deck. And unfortunately, I don't have a red deck with me. But with the powers be, somehow I think I just made this into a red deck. Isn't that pretty cool? But the trick's not over. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. There it is. And of course, the rest are red. We keep the deck. But what about those? You think those are red? I mean, they, they were blue. Let's find out. Look at that. These have become red as well. And all we got left was with our original ace that everything started with. But the trick wouldn't be fun unless the ace was also red. <laughs> 